Hello and welcome to this video about troubleshooting your echo meter in case the warning triangle appears on your sensor display. We'll check a couple of things to figure out what the problem is, tell you how to solve it quickly and effectively. Our first check will be to make sure that we install the echo meter on the tank within 10 minutes of pairing the sensor with the monitor. If you are unsure about this, unplug your echo monitor, wait 10 seconds, and replug it. Don't worry your configuration is still saved. Your echo monitor should now be in learning mode, after which you should pair your sensor with it again by holding it into the alignment pin and waiting until the rising of all 10 bars and the subsequent beep. After you hear the beep, make sure to install your sensor within 10 minutes onto the tank. In the next check, we will ensure the correct mounting of the sensor onto the tank. Make sure that you haven't installed the rocket on pipes or flanges longer than 5 cm, but instead the ultrasonic waves of the sensor have unobstructed reach into your tank. Additionally, check that your tank has no internal indentations that leaves less than 20 cm diameter space vertically under the sensor. As a reference, make sure that your tank would theoretically allow the passing of a basketball from sensor mounting position to the bottom of the tank. Finally. Ensure that the sensor is vertically mounted with an alignment perpendicular to the liquid interface. This third check is essential for everyone living in areas with strong temperature shifts between night and day. It can occur that condensate droplets form on the interface of the sensor, which oftentimes leads to inaccurate measurements and the warning triangle. To remedy this problem effectively and prevent it for the future, we take any type of oil or lubricant, smear it onto a rag or cloth, Fold this cloth together and clean the interface carefully. If you're still having problems with the warning triangle, make sure to check the installation guide and visit our FAQ on eSensorics.com FAQ. For more information about our products, visit www.esensorics.io.